CLT. Clear caution and warning memory. Verify no unexpected errors. OTC, uh, let's work. Top of the liquid, top of the external fuel tank, known as the beanie cap, is being removed at this time. CLT, caution and warning memory clear is complete with no unexpected errors. Copy. Discovery, close and lock your visors and initiate O2 flow. Discovery and work. Seconds and counting. CLS is go for ET LH2 pressurization. T-minus one minute, 30 seconds to launch. Everything remains on track. T-minus one minute and counting to launch a space shuttle discovery. T-minus 50 seconds. Transferring to the shuttle's internal power now. It's running on its onboard three fuel cells. Coming up on go for auto sequence start. The computer's onboard discovery. Control the spacecraft. Let's go for auto sequence start. 25. T minus 25 seconds and counting. 20. T minus 15 seconds and counting. 10. 10 seconds. We have go for main engine start. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Booster ignition and liftoff of Shuttle Discovery. Kambate Kudasai. Best of luck to the International Space Station's newest laboratory. Houston and Discovery roll program. Roger roll, Discovery. Houston now controlling the flight of Discovery, a man-made rising sun on behalf of Japan. Discovery on the proper alignment, heads down, wings level for the eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Four and a half million pounds of hardware and humans taking aim on the International Space Station. Six seconds into the flight, the three liquid fuel main engines now throttling back to 72% of rated performance, going in the bucket, reducing the stress on the shuttle as it goes supersonic. Discovery already five miles in altitude, eight and a half miles downrange, traveling almost a thousand miles an hour. Discovery Houston, go at throttle up. Throttle up. throttle up call acknowledged by Commander Mark Kelly, joined on the flight deck by pilot Ken Ham, flight engineer Ron Garan, and mission specialist Karen Nyberg. Down on the mid deck are Mike Fossum, Aki Hoshide, and Greg Shamatov, heading for a half year on the International Space Station. One minute, 45 seconds into the flight. Discovery 22 miles in altitude, 23 miles downrange. Standing by for solid rocket booster separation. Copy staging. Booster officer confirms staging, a good solid rocket booster separation. Guidance now converging. The onboard computer steering the shuttle for the on-ramp to the highway for the International Space Station. 
Discovery 37 miles in altitude, 50 miles downrange, traveling 3,200 miles an hour. The orbital maneuvering system engines have ignited, providing Discovery with a burst of power for the next 2 minutes 15 seconds. Roger, two engine morale. That call from 